Hello everyone, welcome back to more uh, Pokemon Black. We're right in front of the museum here, and uh, was it Knack Green City? Man, it would take me a while to pronounce the names of these cities here. Alright, now that we have Mr. Norris in place here. Um, let's head on to the museum here. Oh, I completely forgot you were here. Um, well, it's this guy who speaks super fast here. Dude, you speak so quickly. I mean, I can barely read it. I don't know the battle with this mysterious N person. That's got to be standing for something here. N. Seriously. Now, if you kind of pay attention to his Pokémon, they're never the same. His Pokémon are pretty much always gonna be Pokémon in um, a nearby local area. So, as long as you don't, like, repel off everything, um, you, know, you don't explore the wild Pokémon in the area, you should be familiar with what to expect here. So in this case, it's all his Pokémon come from just to the left, where I was doing some level crunching. And seriously, he needs more levels because, uh... This is actually supposed to be a really easy battle. If you don't go to the left, um, this is still really an easy battle. I mean, look at that. Yeah, that was a little too easy for me here. Dude, you're saying some weird crap here that I don't even understand. You know, Zekrom. Yeah, it's one of the two, like, you know, I guess, game legendaries, whatever. Uh, you'll get the other one if you looked at the game box of your game. <laughs> game cart. Okay, so this uh, museum is actually the gym. Again, they actually have their own uh, designs here, rather than just a gym. Uh, they actually have, a, it's like a, any other building, so... Okay, and now you were told that, um... Actually, before I even discuss that, um... Uh, this is, again, this is actually, one part's the museum, the other part's the gym. Uh, this person here takes fossils, so uh, you'll get a fossil later on, and you can get a Pokemon out of it, so... Um, you can consider that for your team if you're interested. Okay, some... random person here. I don't know, that kind of looks like a, like a Dragonite, maybe? I don't know what that looks like. Uh, let's see. What is it, a Meteor here or something? Kind of like the ones from, like, you know, with Deoxys. Okay, I don't know why you want to... bring a stone in there. I mean, couldn't you just pick up any other rock or something? Huh, that's kind of weird. Okay, so the gym is just behind here, and, uh... Um... We'll go in there in just a little bit here, but let's take a... couple extra minutes here to... look around. 
some of the weird stuff around here. Oh, someone's really into stones here and stuff. Some ancient stone there. Okay, so behind here is the gym. And, uh... A little bit of a weird puzzle here, and, uh... With every gym, you'll get some fresh water, which uh, I guess it's still okay right now. Alright, so this is a normal type gym, so if you want high yield, uh, bring a fighting type here. Uh, but you don't really need a fighting type to, to beat this gym. A uh, little bit of cleverness, you'll, you should be able to get around just fine. But uh, just for simplicity, I have Mr. Uh, Norris here. Mr. Norris is basically just going to tear apart this entire gym, as you will see. And I think you have to battle all the trainers here. Um, the library here. use double kicks here. Oh, you can use wide. I don't even think you'll survive double kick here. Not even half of it. Alright, Mr. Norris is going to have some fun in this gym. Alright, so you get some little clues on how to solve this, which is not a very difficult puzzle. I mean, you stumble around enough, you'll find the answers here. Uh, you don't have to read any of this, you just have to get to the back, just kind of click through everything here. Now this question is um, actually pretty simple, you just uh, battled that trainer back there with the Pat Rat, or Patrat, uh, I don't know how that's actually pronounced. Uh, you'll probably be hearing it both ways. That was this uh, Pat Rat here. Again, no penalties for getting it wrong. You'll eventually stumble into the in where you need to go here. Okay, uh, this next clue, um, really there's only two possibilities. Uh, but the actual answer is going behind. So you're just going from front to back here. Yes, uh, that book is describing a train. And again, you gotta battle all the trainers here, so it's not like you're even given an option to skip anyone here. Lily pup here. Ooh, you going know, with the X defense here. Trying to block my fighting type move, huh? Still didn't do you any good. Even one 
kick there still did about three quarters. I mean, because you're in no match against Mr. Norris. Uh, counter, that's a pretty useless move here. Even competitive play, because for the most part, you're going to get hit with special based moves anyway, so. No match for Mr. Norris. Even the ex defendant even. Save your dog. Alright, uh, next question here. Uh, closer to the entrance. Nothing on this side here. I was wondering, like, the back? Is that, is that, like, a door back there or something, or is that just a wall? Alright, so you want to actually head to the front here. And this is what you want to read here. And Puffins, these are, uh, from... Fourth generation games. Uh, use those for Sinnoh contests, which I'm actually really good at. So, I mean, the contests there are like really easy. I mean, I just literally mow through those contests with no difficulty. Even the master ranks, I could care less. I have like little trouble going through them. Okay, now this last clue here is a bit of a puzzle. Um. It looks a lot more complicated than it should be. It's kind of trying to confuse you here, but um, the long story short, all you do is go back one. Now that's it. Uh, the rest of it is just garbage. You just go back one. Or, FYI, um, which bookshelf have you not gone to yet? Think of it that way. Alright, uh, one last trainer here. Kind of interesting, if you kind of connect the dots to, like, which way you need to go, it almost makes an end. Kind of interesting, because you start on the left side, you go up, and then you go diagonal down, and almost make a full end. It's kind of interesting, though, when you think about it. Alright, uh, more normal types to beat up here, and, uh, Mr. Norris is gonna have some target practice here. Look at that. Pretty sure Wave could probably take out most of these with just water guns or something. Definitely shell, shell blades, or even rock smashes, actually. Yeah, I'll just let Mr. Norris, Mr. Norris keep going. Since he got, you know, 30 double kicks, I'm never gonna run out of double kicks here. That's just, like, not fair at all here. And this trainer has three lily pups here. And they're gonna go down the same way here. At least this is, like, a normal type gym. The first gym was, like, no typing. At all, it's just like a random gym. All right, uh, this last book here. you find this random button here that moves the bookshelf. I actually thought at first it was going to be the wall in the back that moves, but uh, put a secret staircase underneath the bookshelf is kind of clever. I wasn't actually expecting that at first. 
Alright, heading on down here, you find the gym leader, and uh, next part we will have our battle for our second badge.